Hello ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to Sunday Chill Day with Euro Truck Simulator. A new series that will be starting every Sunday. We'll be playing Euro Truck Simulator 2 and talk about random topics like I'll choose a topic or several topics that fit into a theme and then we'll talk about it. Before I even start playing, I'll choose a job since we don't have any truck ourselves. So we'll do a quick job. But before I do that, is there any time limit? Offer expires. We have time. Before I do, eh, let's choose a job and then I'll talk. Uh, what do we have? I chose Luxembourg as main headquarters of a thing because why not we're flying industries god damn it uh we should go for yeah from price brussels is there anything cheaper uh brussels Lux uh okay no we want to go far far away so let's choose uh strasbourg is over there let's go to let's go to brussels Let's go to Brussels. Boom. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, first of all, let's meet... Yes, okay, that's good. Okay, let's start this adventure. It's been a long time since I played it, so I might suck. <gasps> I just might suck. And I will probably add uh, some music later on. Again, I didn't have time to add music because of a very specific reason. Oh my god. Okay, that, that was... Oh shit. Oh crap. Come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. No, 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 no. <gasps> wow, what a great start. What a great start. What a great start. We already lost a bunch, a bunch of money. My god. My god. Anyway. I was supposed... Or rather, I was planning... Oh, um... Too fast. Oh, now I'm not too fast. God damn it. I was planning on not fucking this up. I was planning on making this video earlier today. In fact, I was planning on doing so much more during this past today and yesterday. However, let me take a look at the map. I'm really slow at it. I have a new email. I'm sorry. I can't read the email right now. I'm sorry. I'm driving. I'm driving. Yesterday, I came home ready to do some, uh, some stuff for today. So, upload videos of uh, the new Let's Play that I was going to do. I was willing to, was going to do some thumbnails as well, and I was going to do some test streams for today, where I actually wanted to stream. However, this did not happen. In fact, it's 3 p.m., and I just started this. I was actually supposed to be streaming at this time from what I had planned. But no, I'm here doing Euro Truck Simulator for Sunday. Why? Yesterday, I came home ready to do this. I turned on my computer and nothing happened. Well, something happened. It started, I forgot to start my timer. Yay! 
it went online online what a, my god it started the video the windows logo showed and then it went black screen and i could only see my mouse pointer that was it and i tried for eight hours yesterday until midnight to fix it and today i wake woke up at 9 a.m to try and figure this out I didn't so in the end I just deleted Windows and reinstalled it and now I have to say one thing fuck you Microsoft really I, I was so angry I was willing to throw a chair at my computer because I tried everything. I googled for hours trying to fix this problem. Nothing. And it's not in nothing new really for me. I had two similar problems with Windows 8.1 before I changed to Windows 10. It all start I have this computer for what? A little bit over a month now. And still, there are huge problems that I really hate. I hate it so much. The first problem was after two weeks. Some update. Some crappy little Windows update. Deleted my BIOS. My, not my BIOS, my... You, Yuffie, my booting system, my Windows, so I couldn't boot it. It was still on the on the SSD, but I couldn't boot it. So it loaded, and then it just went full black screen. Like I couldn't see, move my mouse. It just didn't work. Point. Because it couldn't boot. Yeah, I tried to boot Windows 8.1, but it couldn't because it had deleted itself. Some update. So, that was a point where I had to reformat my whole SSD and reinstall Windows 8 and reinstall every single program that was on my SSD instead of my... Uh, and also fix my desktop and whatnot. Then, everything was fine until, again, I think after two weeks or so, same problem. Same fucking problem. Do I need to turn? Looks as if I have to turn. Yep, I need to turn. Same problem. Again. Some update. Installed. And the next day, when I tried to turn the computer on, it did not work, did not start. So that sucked. Again. Okay, shit, I need to continue forward. So that... Well, that sucked. That really goddamn sucked. I need to break. That sucked ass. So, I, at that point, I raged and said, okay, screw that. I'm immediately updating to Windows 10 because initially I did not want to update until Windows 10 until end of October. I wanted to wait until end of October to update it, to upgrade, rather, the correct terms. Uh, I scrapped that idea because I was sick and tired of that problem. So, and again, at that there, I had also tried every single possibility to ref to fix it and it did not work. So, again, perfect. Oh shit, traffic traffic well construction so I installed Windows 10 upgraded went to Windows 10 everything was working fine for until yesterday when for some reason it did not work anymore and I was screwed all the plans that I had for today and for yesterday and screwed gone gone with the wind Oh, nice balloons. Focus on the road. Focus on the road. 
Focus on the road, Andrew. Focus on the road. So, all the plans were screwed. So, I spent the entire day yesterday trying to fix it. Did not work. Then I spent today morning trying to fix it. Did not work as well. So, now I'm here, 3 p.m., playing your truck simulator. What I actually wanted to do earlier today in the morning, including another episode of uh, Crusader Kings 2. I actually also wanted to do an announcement video later, but so far nothing yet. But an I will do an announcement video soon enough uh, about some changes. For example, the first change is why am I doing Euro Truck Simulator? That would be one question that I could that you could have and that I need to ha uh, answer. Another question that I need to answer would be Sunday Fun Day, or how I would call it, Chillaxing Fun Day. Something that I want to do, and which Euro Truck Simulator is part of. And, uh, hold on, I'm thinking, I'm thinking that I should probably change to the middle one. Yeah, I'm used to drive on, on the left one because uh, some roads you have only two. In some, some countries you only have two roads, two, yeah, two roads, so two lines rather. And um, one of the lines is also used to get out, get off the highway so that's always weird instead of just having to change direct change the line early like here if I had driven on that road on the right one I wouldn't be able to do this so what the hell am I okay no my cruise control is activated okay strange strange so now I hope no problems anymore I got rid of I reinstalled Windows I had to reinstall almost everything Steam, OBS I think I have to reinstall GTA and I need to reinstall drivers and whatnot. And that sucks because I already did that three times and I just hope I won't do it again and I think I just missed the did I miss did I miss? Wait, what? Wasn't I supposed to continue on the road? It says I still have a bunch of miles left, so I don't think that was it. So, okay. Anyway, that was shit. So I hope it won't happen again. Because if it does, then I'm gonna rage even more. And these are the times where I wish... God, just give me a good thing. Because it is weird. Because in on my laptop that I previously had and used, even for recording, I didn't have a problem. Okay, I had Windows 8.1, no problems. I built myself a PC, everything runs fine, except for Windows, which breaks in so many ways so many ways it really hurts me to see how often it breaks and oh oh crap no i missed i missed the way out oh now i now i get it now i get it okay now i get it where am i driving <coughs> Excuse me. Where am I driving? Well, let me check on the map. Uh. Oh shit. Where am I driving? No! My god. I missed the off road twice. 
the exit. I missed it twice. No, I'm already in the Netherlands. No, that was not the case. That was not my plan. Okay, let's change. Let's let's turn. Let us turn. <laughs> that was not my plan, actually. So the question is. Oh shit, that is not gonna work. <laughs> Hi. Will you give me that moment? Thank you, thank you very much, thank you very much. I apologize, I apologize. That was not my plan. I apologize, I apologize. I'm real, I wasn't focusing on the map, I'm sorry. I wasn't focusing on the map or on the signs. I wasn't paying attention to anything. Like, I just lost a bunch of time. And I know when my ETA is. My ETA is Mondays. 15? Oh, shit. Oh, crap. That is not good. Uh, come on. Go, 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 go. Thank you. Now you wait. So, that was the problem, and I'm happy now that it's gone. At least for now. At least for now it is fixed. I'll see if it's still going to be fixed later on. Oh. Can I? Yes, I can. Thank you. Good, sir. Thank you. So, I uh, hope it is fixed. And I hope I won't have to do this ever again. Because if that's the case, then God, I will break things. Literally. Oh, I need to. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. That was close. I think I did not hit him. I think. I need... had to scratch myself. Probably with the right hand instead of the left hand. I need the left hand to control. Okay, so. I'll see what I can do there. I hope n won't happen again. And I hope this won't take too long. Because I also need to record some Crusader Kings 2. Oh yes, and some Batman Arkham City. Because I'm all out of Batman Arkham City. There's Brussels. Hold on, I've been driving on the same road since the very beginning. <gasps> wow. Wow. I drove past Brussels. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I really drove past Brussels and I did not even notice a single thing. I did not even notice. I was just... Wow. Okay, that is impressive. That is crazy. Like, the fact that I did not notice... Oh, uh, God, that was too fast. The fact that I did not notice that I drove past Brussels. Uh, slower, slower, slower. It was weird. I could have been here probably an hour ago, but for some reason I just drove past it. I don't give a shit. I just drive past it. It's still 90 here? Damn it, I never know when to stop. I never know when to stop here. Because it's too close. It's too close and I don't know when to stop. <laughs> Please don't break. Please don't break. Please don't break. Oh crap, I need to turn to the other way. Brussels is covered. Whoa! That is cool. That is cool. Let's not break something. Crap. I just broke something. My god, it is difficult. Okay, we're gonna park precise. We're gonna do that precisely. 
Like, let's change the camera. Okay. Oh shit, no. No, no, come on, come on. There we go. Nope, that is the wrong way. That is the wrong way. Come on. No, 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 Fuck! Why did I decide to park backwards? Just position yourself. There. Can you just drive backwards without anything happening? Please. Oh shit. Not yet, not yet. Come on, come on. Nope, 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 nope. That is hard. That is really hard. I just don't even know how to do this. <laughs> come on. Oh, yes, 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 that is. Exactly what I want. Come on. Come on. Perfect. Now just drive backwards. Just drive backwards. Slowly driving backwards. Boom. Done. Done. We lost a bunch of money. <laughs> we lost a bunch of money. God damn it. <laughs> But yay, we finished. Uh, we can level up. What should I level up in? Control on duty. Delivers up to five. Uh, let's go to high val. No, nah, long distance. Long distance. Let's check our emails. Brand new Scalia trucks for sale. Thank you. I don't even give a damn. I don't give an even damn. I mean, come on. Until I can't even buy a truck, like trusted customers only. Okay. I think a truck is like 20k, 200k, and I have 4k, so that's gonna take a while until we can. Uh, let's do another one. Quick job and talk about a second topic that I want to talk about. Let's start from Brussels. See what Brussels has for us. Oh, to Reims. Or to Liège. Do we have something else? Something total. Luxembourg, Brussels for 3. 3.5. 3.3. To Reims. Yeah, let's drive to Reims. With an Scania. Let's drive some paper around. Oh, we have a new email. Well, I'll check the email once I'm done. Okay, let's drive out. 
Scania looks okay-ish. A lot better than the other one that we drove before, the Iveco. I didn't like the Iveco. Come on, we can do it, we can do it. I know we can. The boom, I knew it. When's the line? There's the line. We need to drive over there. So, second topic I want to talk about is the recent news that Call of Duty, the new one, Black Ops 3, is it? Yes, Black Ops 3, is not going to be released with a single player campaign on the old consoles. So, not on PlayStation 3 and not on, Play on Xbox 360. They won't have, um, excuse me. My nose. Uh, they won't have single player. So they will only have multiplayer. Because the single player is, as you might know, uh, a cool co op four player single player, and it's apparently too much for the old consoles. Now, the question that I'm asking myself is why? Why are you scrapping the mul the single player from the old console versions? Why? What's the reasoning behind it? Do you want to get people to buy new consoles in order to get the full experience? Because if that is the case, then don't release a version for the old consoles. Then you won't have to scrap something away to l deliver a, a only part of the game. And why are you scrapping the single player? I mean, I don't know. Another email, okay? I don't know exactly what uh, the multiplayer service are like, if they are like a uh, fixed service that you need to buy, or if it's some sort of uh, like in Modern Warfare 2, where someone is the host and everybody plays on his thing. Like, if that is the case, then I don't have that much problem for... Oh, that was close. I was not even paying attention. I just saw the car at the last moment. I was like, oh shit, that's gonna hurt. But it didn't. That's cool. But still, the question remains. Why would you not... I mean, okay, I get it. Probably there's a lot of multiplayer. But still, if that's the case, if one person is the host and you can always play it, even if the service gets shut, if, even if the game is no longer supported, then I wouldn't mind that much. But if it's fixed service that you need to buy and people go on it, then I don't see the purpose of it. Because that game will probably not be supported for long. And once it is no longer supported, you, the game is useless to you. Because you only have the multiplayer version of it. You don't have any single player. If, they, if the single player was on it and no multiplayer, that would also be a downsize. And especially uh, Call of Duty shooters are heavily rely, rely heavily on the multiplayer component. Because that's what keeps the game actually going. The single player is just an added bonus, mostly. But still, a single player... I would have scrapped the multiplayer instead of a single player. Because this... A single player gives you a lot more than just multiplayer. Multiplayer will be shut off in uh, probably a few years. While... And people are probably not going to play it, the multiplayer, and, until next year when the next game is released. Then nobody is going to play it. So where's the point in that? So... I don't get it. 
I get it that they want to still get the last money out of the old consoles. But as, but I expected people like uh, Sony, which they are partnered, to say no. Don't release for PlayStation 3. Don't. Release it just for PlayStation 4 and Xbox uh, One. In case of Microsoft saying no, just release from Xbox One. Because that's a game, that's a console seller. People will buy a console for these games. Especially if it's not going to be released on the old consoles. I mean, it makes no sense to support old consoles, but just give them scrap features. Like, if, if people don't care about the single player, tattoo, ta-ta, ambulance. Uh, if people don't care for the single player, wait, what? I need to pay? Wait, what? Since when is that? Uh, okay. That is weird. Hello? Here. Since when do I have to pay a toll? Oh, we're in France, aren't we? Yeah, ah, crap. Goddamn France. We need to pay to drive around France. Shit. Crusader Kings 2. The game I'm going to play next after I play this. Finish this. Anyway, back to the topic at hand. I don't get it. I don't get it. Sure, if you don't release it, you're losing a good m a bunch of money if you don't release it because there's probably still a lot of people that are uh, not, that don't own a new console. But still, Call of Duty would be the perfect argument uh, to change. Say, it's not going to be released for old consoles, so you have to buy a new console to play it. Because it is ridiculous that, I don't know, how long is the old, is it year two since PlayStation, since the new consoles released? I'm not sure. But it's still weird that there's still so many old consoles around. Because the change should come. People should change. Especially considering that the PC that I now have is a lot more powerful than in any of these consoles out there. So I'm excited to see how long these new consoles are going to survive if PCs nowadays are already so much stronger than anything they will offer. And according to Sony, they want to keep the PlayStation 4 around for at least 10 years. Like, PlayStation 3 was around for 7 years? So that's a bunch. I mean, in... In 10 years, 7, 10 years, PCs will break consoles into little pieces of crap. Like, not just break them in half, but break them into non-existence. They will punch it right into space past Pluto. I mean, it has to happen. If, cons if a computer nowadays is already a lot stronger than a console and a console is apparently going to survive or they plan on it staying here for 10 years then they got to get a lot of games exclusively because I don't think they will survive that long well survive I don't think they will stay here for that long just with hardware because the hardware will be outdated it is already outdated in certain cases. Because I don't see any other way to stop it. Like, to keep the consoles going, you need exclusive titles. And exclusive titles are bullshit. I mean, Point Case, Tomb Raider. It's gonna be released in November, I think? For Xbox One, placed it. Computers, uh, computer owners, so I will have to wait until uh, February or January to buy and play it. And 
PlayStation users, these poor saps, will have to wait until 2016, holiday 2016, to be able to play it. That's one year. At that point, no one is probably going to care about Tomb Raider, except if it was a good game. But even then, I don't think anyone's going to care. Like, honestly. Okay, that was... <laughs> a sudden stop. I did not expect the tall to be that close. Okay. But still, it's weird. And it's a piece of crap. Like, I noticed the same thing with... Um, uh, WWE 2K15 that okay the game for itself was a piece of crap but the fact that they released the game for PC months later like in March was released in October for consoles and it, it went on to PC release for March no publicity whatsoever they just throw it threw it out there and the game itself was also shit well, not shit, but it wasn't very good. So no one really bought it. No one really was interested in it. No one really saw it. And I was actually looking forward for WWE 2K15 until the game sucked. Until the game was just crap. Just the biggest piece of crap that I've ever seen. That was sad, really. Because I was looking forward for that game. I was hyped. I was... Every single day I tried to look on the internet for news about the game. I was hyped. But nothing happened. Like, nothing. <laughs> Not a single thing. The game just... Was really shitty. Really crappy. And now I'm excited for 2K16. Because... It looks great. A r huge roster. Even though some guys and girls are missing. Especially the four horsewomen are missing. And a lot of other people are missing that I really want to see. Because I've looked at it. The Divas Division. The diva Divas that they have. My god, there's nothing worthwhile there. No wrestler there where I would say... Yeah, I'll take her. She's good to lead the division. Like, none. Maybe Natalia and Paige. Well, will play ass. But the rest, I'm not gonna play it in. No, I'm not. Just, no. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna discover this town. Come on, drive, Vesser. Drive, 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 drive. There you go. There you go. So that was weird. Like, nothing really worthwhile in there. Crap. I couldn't break. Wait, what? It was still red. Ah, oh, come on, no! He drove forward. Fuck it. He drove forward, and I thought it was green. Else, I wouldn't have driven. F continued because it w he he continued. I thought. It <sighs> Fucking idiot. Thanks a lot. Fuck face. Anyway. Is it over here? Yes, it is over here. And uh, the phone is ringing. The phone is ringing. I'm not here. I'm not here. I can't. I can't. You'll have to wait until I'm done. Okay, screw it. Okay. This is it for... Sunday fun day. With Euro Truck Simulator 2, two topics, well, three topics, Windows, Call of Duty, and a short piece of WWE 2K16, which I'm looking forward, and the Divas Division sucks so far. The, the rest of it they have. 
but other than that, no topics anymore. So, thanks for watching on the Sunday when this gets released. And I'll be taking on Crusader Kings 2 now for some time and then switch over to uh, Batman Arkham City. Completely forgot. So, thanks again for watching and have a nice Sunday. And hopefully you get a fantastic start of the week. Goodbye.